it's kind of taken this long to come up with the right idea, and Stephen's new idea about having the theme park fully realized uh, was really kind of the anchor and the key to this story. And so um, we've been pursuing that script and that story, and uh, then to find someone as enthusiastic and then to find someone as enthusiastic and knowledgeable about the first three movies as Colin has been uh, was a real gift for us. So I think uh, having Colin's youthful en enthusiasm and, and Stephen's you know, sagely wise storytelling uh, to be there to support Colin has been really great. Well, I think Colin's uh, Colin's vision for the movie was that it was very real, that the theme park is real, it exists. So we went to great lengths to create a world that was real and to build the sets and to go to Hawaii again to the real jungle and create as much real um, environments as we could for the actors, which also helps them, I always believe. So it's not a green screen atmosphere, it's a real atmosphere. And I think that makes it much more believable. A lot of people are coming to this movie to see the dinosaurs, and we have lots of great ones. We have ones that you're familiar with from the first movies, and we have some new ones. Um, the new ones are particularly exciting because one of them is a genetically designed uh, new dinosaur, which we're calling the Indominus Rex. And Indominus is really, turns out to be something that's kind of exciting and then gets completely out of control.